All right, the latest on Dan Rather. <laughs> well, Dan wants to go to, uh, I think he is in Afghanistan, right? Is he over there already? No, I don't think so. I, I know he wants to go really badly. What's he that? might be, um, like, on a border. I don't even know where Dan is right now, or where uh, Tom is right now. Well, basically, Dan Rather wants to go over there to do some reporting. Mm -hmm. And now Tom broke off very pissed off because now, once again, uh, Dan Rather has one up on him. Yeah, I mean, uh, uh, that's the place to be if you're a reporter. And it turns out it's a lot more dangerous. Journalists, uh, eight journalists have been killed. One American's been killed in, in combat. So, you know, the journalist uh, out doing the, the military as far as getting themselves killed... So I don't know if it's safe. And Geraldo's running around with a cowboy hat. Good. Put Geraldo a, looks Put a hysterical. target on the top of your head. Have you seen Geraldo? He's out there. He's interviewing uh, people, and he's got this big cowboy hat on. I'm a cowboy on a steel horse I ride. I'm wanted, <laughs> dead, dead or alive. alive. No, no, uh, no, no, no. <laughs> Look at Richard <laughs> Cheese. Hey, we, hey, know, know. we know that's that okay. It's okay. <laughs> Sorry, baby. <laughs> so, uh, I yeah. don't think it's safe, though, for Tom Brokaw, who's 61 years old. To be a trotting across. Picture your grandpa out there trotting across the desert uh, looking for a story. He wants to be by a marine base um, at Kandahar, one of the uh, airstrips that's there that was made into a marine base. And he wants to hang out with the Marines. With the Marines, sure. And uh, I guess get the story. Well, he wants to get it before Dan Rather because they're in uh, fierce competition with e each other lately. Yeah, that's what it seems to be. And um, Peter Jennings. Well, he's a pussy. <laughs> Peter Jennings is the biggest pussy in the world. While me and Jan Rather fight it out to see who's going to be in Af Afghanistan. Afghanistan. <laughs> Peter Jennings wants to stay home. He's a he's a panty waist. What's the matter, Jennings? Are you quitting on me? Are you quitting on me, Jennings? <laughs> Tom Brokaw, NBC, Nightly News. Jennings, are you quitting on me? Then quit, you slimy little walrus-looking piece of Get the off my obstacle. Get the down off my obstacle now. Move it. I'm going to rip your off so you cannot contaminate the rest of the world. I will motivate you, Jennings. You short every on the Congo. <laughs> Hey, that was from a movie, Mr. Brokaw. Hey, I'm uh, inspired uh, by uh, the Marines here. Well, I, I hope to be inspired by them when I broadcast law, 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 in, in person <laughs> from the Marine base at Canada. Are well, Dan Rather's in Afghanistan. Dan Rather's pretty close to, to broadcasting live from Afghanistan. Mr. Well, Brokaw. I got a problem with Dan Rather, oh, yeah? too. Tom Broca, NBC Nightly News. My mission would rather is to proceed up the Nung River in a Navy patrol boat, pick up Rather's path in Nu Mang Ba, follow it, and learn what I can along the way. When I find Rather, I will infiltrate his team by whatever means available and terminate Rather's command. Terminate Rather's command with extreme prejudice. Tom, that's, that's that son of a bitch. That's 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 from a movie. I don't recall any of that. I'm inspired just the thought of being over there and saying things and firing weapons and helping the Marines yeah. over there. It just gets me hot. I feel hot. That's all I want to do. Hey, look look, look out! Here comes the enemy at twelve o'clock. Twelve o'clock. Twelve, 12 He's coming right in front of us. <laughs> you know, it just makes me feel so good. Imagine me saying that. Tom Brokaw, NBC Nightly News, live from Afghanistan. You want to be right in the middle of the action. Right? I want to be right in the action. I want to, if somebody gets hit, yeah. you take a look at this lump of <laughs> Remember what he looks like. You <laughs> up in a firefight, and I goddamn guarantee you a trip out of the bush in a body bag. <laughs> uh, here, <laughs> you keep your Wired tight at all times, and that goes for you, for brains. You don't sleep on no f***ing ambush. And the next son of a bitch I catch copping Z's in the bush, I am personally going to take an interest in seeing them suffer. I f*** you not. Doc, tag him and bag him. <laughs> I'm inspired just the, uh, being there. Look at that. Wait. 
Do you smell that? Uh, That's napalm, son. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing else in the world smells like that. I lo I lo lo I I'm attracted to the smell of napalm in the morning. <laughs> You know, one time we had a hill bomb for 12 hours. When it was over, I walked up. We didn't find one of them. Not one stinking dink body. <laughs> the smell, you know, that gasoline smell. The whole hill smelled like victory. <laughs> Someday this war's going to end. Tom, you're not in the Marines, though. You're just a newsman. This is wonderful. I love it. I love being with the Marines. God has a... On for Marines, because we kill everything we see. He plays his games, we play ours. To show our appreciation for so much power, we keep having packed with fresh souls. God was here before the Marine Corps, so you could give your heart to Jesus, but your ass belongs to the Corps. You're not part of the Marines. I feel like it. Yeah. I'd love to go over there. <laughs> look out, look out, I'll throw my body on a hand grenade. <laughs> For my brother, Marine, 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 Marine. I love the military. Yeah. Even though I'm 61 years old, it doesn't matter. I would just lo love to get in there and get a piece of the action. Get Osama's ass. Yeah, why don't you go in the caves and uh, try to hunt him? I'll hunt do that. I'll be a tunnel rat. Yeah. Here I am, Tom Brokaw, NBC Nightly News. I'm in the tunnels here in Afghanistan, and I'm ready to kick some ass. Come on out, Osama. Come on, I see you. I see you. I didn't start this. I didn't draw first blood. You started this. Ah, ah, ah. Adrian! Oh, Tom. I don't know. That was a fighting movie. Yeah. What are you doing? Stick to the that's regular a, movie. That's Rambo. Yeah, yeah blow them up. <laughs> sand monkeys. I'll kill all the sand monkeys. There you go. Kiss my ass. Tom Brokaw, NBC Nightly News. I can't wait to get over there. I, I cannot wait to get over there. You f tools. <laughs> Rather, rather, I'm going to give you three seconds, exactly three <laughs> seconds to wipe that stupid looking grin off your face or I will gouge out your eyeballs and skull <laughs> you. <laughs> the answer to that one, you pussy boy, rather, rather, you best un yourself and start <laughs> me Tiffany Cufflinks or I will definitely <laughs> you up. <laughs> Rather, you will give your rifle a girl's name because this is the only <laughs> you people are going to get. Your days of <laughs> banging old Mary Jane Rottencrotch through her pretty pink <laughs> panties are over. Rather. <laughs> I just love being there. I could smell it. Smell it. Smell it. Smell it in the air. Can you? I can't say it, but I can smell it. <laughs> oh, wow. Let oh. me hear you pronounce Taliban, Tom. The bad guys. <laughs> That's how absolutely Tom Brokaw, NBC, Nightly News, this ain't your show, Elias. You sound motivated, Mr. Brokaw. Well, I am. Yeah. Rather was full of <laughs> Rather was a crusader. Now, I ain't got no problem with a man who does what he's told, but when he don't, the machine breaks down. <laughs> and when the machine breaks down, we break down. And I ain't going to let that happen from any of you, not one. Looks like uh, Mr. Brokaw uh, watched a lot of movies on the train back I, from Boston. I have no idea what you're talking about. Got a lot of DVDs in your back pocket, huh, Mr. Brokaw? Well, I, I'm I, I'm inspired. Tom Brokaw, NBC Nightly News, is inspired yeah. by uh, 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 victories of the Americans in the past. Isn't it? <laughs> 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 Hamburger, NBC Nightly News, live from Afghanistan.
<laughs> uh, Tom, how do you lead the women and children? No, it's how can you shoot innocent women and children? <laughs> the answer, easy, you just don't lead them as much. Well. If they run, they're VC. If they stand still, they're well-disciplined VC. <laughs> Rather, get your boots on. <laughs> and the next time I catch you spraying skeeter repellent on your <laughs> feet, I'm going to court martial your nigger ass. <laughs> Whoa, Tom. Can't say that on the night. Out in the news. field when death is around the corner, you say what you want. Tom Brokaw, NBC, Nightly News.